Hey everybody, what's going on today? Hey, uh, today's video, I mean, you know, haven't, haven't had one out in a while, and I do apologize for that. It's just been brutally hot up here, for one thing, and uh, just a lot of work going on. So uh, today, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna power wash the frame, get that cleaned up, and uh, let it dry off, grease everything, get it ready, and just a few odds and ends to get done on the truck um, before it gets too late in the season. So let me get started. So hang on. All right. So. Anyways, today, uh, I've been putting off for a while, it's just been so busy, but I want to get the frame power washed on it. Um, it's pretty clean, but, it's, you know, there's a lot of, there's a lot of crap in there, too. You know, I got, I got to replace the hoses here, the lines, all that I want to replace, because it's old. You know, just, eh, odds ends, I guess you call it, right? So, I'm going to get this cleaned up right here. Uh, the frame's not too bad, but uh, back here, it could use some attention, there's a little bit of... Nah, it's just road use, I guess, you know, there's a lot of, a lot of dirt in there, so I'm gonna get all that cleaned up today, and, uh, let it dry off a little bit, then we'll just go around, we'll grease everything we could possibly grease on it, and, uh, then I'll get going on that anyway, so, and, uh, one other thing, too, there's, if you can see, there's, uh, a trailer here, it's, uh, 48 foot Great Dane, I believe it's in 1990, but I'm not positive, uh, but we just had it moved here. I was, I was gonna move it with my truck, but try backing up under it, and uh, the fenders were hitting. So either my fifth wheel is just too low. Uh, I gotta take the fenders off it for a little while just to move that trailer, because uh, the parking lot is getting is getting paved next week, I believe. So I gotta get everything off the parking lot. So I gotta move this trailer down the street a little bit. Um, but I just wondering, I mean, uh, what do you guys think about this? Also, I'm on. Anyways, um, is the fifth wheel just too low, or is it the fenders, or should I put a, like a shim kit in there or something to raise the fifth wheel up? I don't know. I really don't want to lose the fenders, so if you guys have any uh, advice, let me know. Definitely appreciate it. Yeah, this is the trailer here. It's, a, it's an old one. It's about the same year as the truck almost. The truck's a 91. I think this is a 90. I don't know. But it does have air ride, which is pretty good. I mean, it's not my trailer, so... Uh, it's my brother's i just got to just have to move it his truck is in the shop being worked on so he can't move it right now so something to do i guess right all right so let's get the truck fired up and we'll start the power wa washer up and get it cleaned up so hang on
I guess that's it for the power washing for now um it's definitely 100 percent cleaner yeah it looks a lot better now there's not all that mud that's something up in the frame up there that's not there so it looks better than it did you know uh i'll bring it down the road i have to get some fuel anyway so i'm gonna go down and get some fuel in the truck quick uh we can really dry it off like that and then i'll come back and we'll throw some uh i got a pb blaster i think i'll use that for now uh, I didn't bring my grease gun with me, but I'll have to bring that later because I'm sure there's a lot of grease fittings in here that need to be greased. But that will be uh, probably another day. But for now, that is it for the power wash. And uh, yeah, it needs a little bit of ride down the street, so we're going to get some fuel in it. All right, guys, I'm not sure what your fuel prices in your town are, but this is uh, 501 a gallon. So I'm just going to get $100 a day. So I'll put a 50 inch tank. That was a trip to the fuel station anyway. It wasn't very long, but um, I really don't have anywhere to set a camera up in here. So I got to get some kind of camera mount up here somewhere. At least I can record some footage of actually going down the road with the damn thing, you know. Uh, but anyways, uh, so I went to get fuel for it. And I spent $100. Right? <laughs> 100 bucks got me just under 20 gallons of fuel. 501 a gallon. What are you going to do, I guess, right? It is getting better, but it's got a long ways to go. All right, guys, that's it for today. Um, yeah, I didn't put any uh, grease on anything yet. Uh, I was going to put WD-40 on a lot of the parts, but um, I'm going to let it dry off a little more. I might hit it with the power washer one more time, but there's still some dirt on it. Um, but that's it for today. So hey, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Uh, I really appreciate you hanging around for a little bit of time here, and I'll have some more videos coming out in the near future. So thanks again, guys.